Hello everybody, Little Simmer here, and I'm back with another speed build in The Sims 3. This house, <laughs> the roof took me forever to figure out, and you'll see that here in just a moment. <laughs> um, but it took me ages, it seems, to finally figure out what I wanted to do. But once I did, the house finally started coming together, and... Um, it came out really nice, so I like it. This house is called Rocky Top Boulevard, and it has three bedrooms and four bathrooms. Now, I didn't intend for the house to have that many bathrooms. I just, I don't know what was wrong with me. I just made, I guess started making rooms, and I was like, oh, that's a bathroom, that's a bathroom. <laughs> Oh yeah, you know what? You know what sounds nice? Another bathroom. <laughs> it was, it was really funny. But um, this house is really pretty. I really like it. Um, and it's all open concept on the on the main floor except for the bathroom. I think the I think the only thing that's closed off on the downstairs is the bathroom. Um. And another thing that's funny, you know how, like, usually when you're making garages, if you want to put a garage door, you make the wall, like, six sim tiles wide to make it even and whatnot? I mis I miscalculated <laughs> and made it seven, so I put, like, a little, I, I put, like, a really cute little door. You'll see that here in a moment, too. Um, but... But yeah, we're getting ready to work on the roof, and this is where I have the most trouble. <laughs> like, I always end up using those hipped roofs, and I wanted to, like, not use them. Because there's going to be a lot of peaks in this house, and... Um... <clears throat> and sometimes peaks don't look the best, especially especially when they poke out the other side like that. And, um, yeah, and then I wanted this little oval-shaped room with, like, that, um, octagonal, oct octagonal, whatever that word is, <laughs> octagonal roof. <laughs> um, but, like, I was having problems with that, and it kept going over the edges of it, and it was so annoying. I was having so many problems with this roof. I was like, you know what, screw it. I'm not going to keep messing with it. So I just... Do we keep it like that? I'm pretty sure we take away that hipped roof. But yeah, we take away the hipped roof. I was like, come on, you can do it. <laughs> Figure it out, come on. <laughs> This is painful, you guys. I <laughs> still haven't figured it out yet. Oh my god. This is funny to watch. <laughs> but anyway, how's everybody doing? I'm doing okay. I just got off work two and a half hours ago. And everybody's asleep here, so that's why I'm doing my voiceover so late. <laughs> I usually wait until like the daytime where I can be a little bit louder. But it's really, I don't like talking when people are awake, because I feel like I'm talking to nobody. Well, I am, technically. Like, I'm talking to you guys, but, you know, you guys aren't there to answer me, so it feels weird. <laughs> um, oh, something I did want to talk about briefly. I've been getting a lot of comments on, like, different parts of my first Build With Me series that I did, actually asking for, like... Um, the link to download the house. I was dumb and I didn't I didn't upload it because for some reason I didn't I didn't think I needed to because it was a build with me so I figured that anybody that was watching it was building the house with me anyway. But that was like so long ago. I only remember when I made it. Um problems breathing tonight and I don't know why. 
anyway, yeah, um, if you ask anything about, like, where to download that house that I did the build with me at, on, I won't be able to point you in any direction to get it because I didn't upload it because I didn't think I needed to. Um, and I deleted the house after I uploaded it, or after I uploaded the last part because I wanted to make room for more speed builds. Um, but I promise the next build with me that I do, I will upload the house when I'm done so you guys can download it. But I didn't think that I needed to do that because, you know, it was a build with me. I thought people were going to be building along with me. But I promise I will. I will upload the, the next one. <laughs> I've been thinking about doing an, another one soon. Also, <laughs> I forgot that like foyers need to be like, generally foyers need to be like four tiles wide. Just for like, they don't need to be, but like a door is typically, like a really nice door is typically like two square, like two sim tiles wide. And to make it look even, you know, gen gen you would like generally, you would put the foyer four tiles wide. That way there'll be like one one wall tile on either side. If that makes any sense, I'm pretty sure it doesn't. But but yeah, we're just working on the windows, putting little. And I'm just noticing this now. I wanted, I probably should have put some shutters on that ambitions window. Um, but I thought I thought this, like the windows turned out really nice. Like this is a different kind of. It looks different, and that's what I, I love it. It looks different than the rest of the houses that I build. I use the same siding, of course. <laughs> but um. I typically okay so that setting that I use it's um it has like a woody like feel like look to it like it's wood and I usually keep the wood texture on there and then I just like change the colors because I love how it looks but um in this house I decided to make it white and then like change the color like you make it look different. And I wanted rock on that, but I didn't on that little like octagonal octagonal octo octagonal whatever it's called. Um also if you hear noise in the background, that's my ceiling fan. It's super loud, I don't know why. <sighs> but yeah, I wanted in the beginning I wanted to have that little Octo octagonal shape where those windows are. I wanted that to be um, rock, but then like none of the rocks looked like good because I don't know if it's just like the the way that the light's hitting the house. But every time I would put like a certain colored rock on there, it would look different than if I put it on a different part of the house. Like it looked lighter and I didn't like it. It, it didn't flow right with the house. And so I decided to put um, different stuff on it. But yeah, we're finally inside the house. Wow. And I decided to use... <sighs> God, I don't know what's wrong with me. I, I Every time I do a speed build and every time I do the voiceover, I always like... I'm always like not able to breathe <laughs> and I don't know why um, but I didn't okay so I didn't furnish anything upstairs I just furnished the downstairs like usual <laughs> um, but after I got done building the house I moved one of my families in that I was playing and I, um, I decorated the upstairs <laughs> Because that's what I always do, right? Like, I always, like, whenever I download houses, I always, like, delete 
like if they did the upstairs, like if they decorated it, I'll like delete the furniture and like put my own stuff in it. And so I don't I don't ever bother decorating the upstairs. I think I decorated the upstairs in one of my speed builds, but like I came back the next day because I was like I was like over it. I was like, bitch, no, I need to do something else. Um, but I came back to it the next day and I furnished the upstairs. Um, anyway, I know I, uh, something else I wanted to talk about. It's just like a quick little, it's not like, a, it's not really a rant. It's just like a sad thing. Um. Most of you probably know that, like, I talk about Sen Simmer a lot because she's my favorite Sim, Simmer YouTuber. But she hasn't really, she posted on, like, on Instagram saying that she's not really feeling, like, building, like, on Sims very much anymore. And it's really sad because, like, I binge watch, like, all of her speed builds, like, all the time. That's where I get like most of the inspiration for my speed builds is from her. And um like I binge watch all of her build of me's and, and it's just really sad because she's she's like really like super sweet and she's like she's like my favorite simmer like YouTuber ever. <laughs> um her and Girl Made Pixels and it's really sad because Girl Bates Pixels doesn't upload anymore either. And I don't think, I'm not sure if Zen Simmer is gone, like, for good or if she's just needing a, like, a break. Because I totally get it. Like, I was, <laughs> I haven't been uploading for, like, very long, like, at all. And I already, like, took a break. <laughs> I think I took, like, a month because I was uploading, like, a speed build every week or two and I think I have like 12 no, I have more than that I have more speed builds than that don't I I, th I think I do uh, I'd have to look <laughs> I don't know how many speed with speed builds I have but um but I also have the build with me series and and I have a bunch of other videos too that I uploaded and I totally get it, like, people tend to get burnt out on things if they're doing said thing, like, on a daily basis, and if they're doing the same thing every single day. And, um, I know in, like, a few of her speed builds, she says that she's, like, built three houses in one day, and I'm like, how? <laughs> how can you do it? <laughs> Teach me. Because I'd love to get to that point to where, like, I'm building, like, something, you know, that's pushing more, like, content out for you guys. But, like, I feel like I'd get burnt out so fast if I were to do that. And, like, this is, like, my favorite game right now. This is, like, my <laughs> The Sims. Like, it's, it's, like... <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> anyway. But yeah, it's just super... It's not, like, sad. Because, like... Like, it's sad that she's not uploading anymore right now. And like I said, I don't think she's gone for good. It's just, like... I don't know. It's just... It's kind of sad, because she makes really good, like stuff like like she she builds she's like an amazing builder but everybody needs a break now and then and you know we'll be we'll all be like you know be here for her when she comes back but anyway if you're watching this Zen Simmer Katie I don't think she ever will watch this video <laughs> at all but if you do ever watch this, know that we all love you and we'll be here when you get back. Girl, take your time. <laughs> anyway, that's enough of that. <laughs>
Let's talk about the house, shall we? We've hardly talked about this house. You've listened to me rant through almost this entire video. Um, this, I couldn't figure out where to put, like, the kitchen and where to put the living room. Like, I was going to put the kitchen where the living room is. And then I was going to put the living room where the kitchen is. So I was like, eh, maybe not. <laughs> and yeah, it's a really tiny living room. But it gets the job done, like, for the family that I built it for. Because there's only, like, two, two people and a dog. <laughs> and so, like, it's just like a starter family. Like a little starter home. I don't even want to say a starter home because, like... We're already at like 71,000 simoleons. <laughs> and that's like a lot for a starter home. So it's not really a starter home. It's like a higher income home. I would love to live in a house like this, to be honest. Um, but I think I'm going to leave you guys here. I'm pretty sure we just finish up the dining room. And then we finish off um, doing little other things. Um, the link to download the house will be in the description below, as well as my Instagram and my Twitter. Um, so yeah, don't forget to comment and subscribe if you're new. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye guys.